guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I am here for another review or another mascara review. Yes, I am an honor roll with these reviews and have purchased actually three new mascaras in the past few weeks. So the first one I already did a review, which is the CoverGirl Plumpify Mascara. I'm gonna put a link in the description box down below. And today I'm going to do a review on this Revlon Ultimate All-in-One Mascara. I actually have been using it for a week now, so it's already open, but I just want you to see how it looks like. This is the packaging, and I'm sure you've seen all of these. This is a drugstore brand. You'll see if you're from Canada, Shoppers, Drugstore, Rexall, um, London Drugs, they're everywhere, even Walmart, um, Superstore, Save On. I'm pretty sure you'll you've seen this. So yeah, I purchased this. The retail price of this is eight dollars ninety nine cents. I'm pretty sure of that. But last week, this um, mascara is actually on sale at the Shoppers Drug Mart. I got one. Uh, I got one here from Sherwood Park. It's actually only $6.99 when I purchased this last week. So I've been using this mascara for about a week now. So today I am actually using uh, just all these mascara. No eye makeup on. Well, actually, I only have my highlighter, but no eyeliner. I didn't curl my mas my, my eyelashes. Just the uh, Revlon Ultimate All-in-One. And as you can see, they look pretty nice. So anyway, yeah. Um... Enough of me talking, but let's go ahead with my thoughts on this Revlon Ultimate All-in-One Mascara. Alright, this is me applying the first coating of the Revlon Ultimate All-in-One Mascara. Now I just want to show you the difference between two eyes, one without the mascara on and the other one with two coatings of the Revlon Ultimate All-in-One Mascara. Okay, so let's just um, see what does it say. So I got, first of all, I got the blackest black. Um, it comes in uh, different colors. Um, I think there's the blackest black, the black, and the brown. And what does it say is it says this, masca this mascara or this particular mascara is a high impact formula delivers the ultimate five benefits in one. So it says it will give you volume there that's volume second length and yes um, number three definition lift definitely oh my gosh so you can see rich intense color first of all volume yes I got the volume that I like um, if you seen other youtubers did um, some of them didn't like it some of them actually like it I do personally like the volume that it gave my eyelashes I like how it lifted my eyelashes without me using my eyelash curler and also let me just show you the one um, remember when I did a review on that cover girl plumpy plumpy Fi mascara I really did like the one but this one the brush is really small and I just like it this is at first, I'm like, um, is it too small? But you know what? It actually works well with the kind of eyelashes that I have. I think that, you know what? I think that every uh, mascara works differently for the type of eyelashes that we have. But for my type of eyelashes, like what I said before, I, I have... Um, already long lashes but they're they don't have volume so I'm look, always looking for a volume so this one pretty much gave my lashes the volume that I like it it actually lifted my eyelashes like how I like them and also you know what at first when you take it out and you see it's very liquidy but when you apply it on like so it dries up really quick and you know what it's good about the this mascara as I, I swear i promise you i use this for like eight hours or more than that um the other day when i went to the christening and all that stuff it did not smudge at all it didn't transfer no smudging usually it will transfer up here or here but no promise and and you know what see i just applied this and see no transfer it may seem so liquidy at first, but I promise you it will not transfer. See how it didn't transfer? That is what I am raving about this mascara. I, I promise this one will not smudge. Doesn't matter if you have oily eyelids. I do 
get oily on my lids here but no transfer i'll insert a clip here of the day of the first day that i started using this mascara i went to work that day and it didn't transfer at all at the end of the day it was still smudge proof on my uh, upper eye and even on my lower lashes so I'm so happy with this mascara and also what I like about this it's so easy to use like let's go back to the wand it's very easy to use so it just glides on smoothly it will be it will look li liquidy at first but it just gets into the lashes and it's really good in using because of the wand itself it's so easy to get into the bottom lashes as well so I'm trying today this uh, Revlon Ultimate All-in-One Mascara for the first time. No, I didn't use any eyelash curler but you see it really gave my eyelashes that lift. Oh my gosh, I am so impressed with this one. It says here that um, it will give you volume length, definition, and lift. Rich, intense color. So far, I'm really, really liking it. I will just see at the end of the day. It's about 12 noon right now. Um, I'll just see at the end of the day. I'm gonna go to work. So I'll be there for about five, six hours. I'll see if it will transfer or, or if it will smear. I just want to see that. But I really like it so far. I love how it looks like on my eyelashes. So I'll see you guys at the end of the day. Alright, so it's now about 9.35. 9.30 something um, I got home from work and um, after five or six hours that I've been using this it still looks good like see the curls held up really good there's no smudging usually at the end of the day there's a little bit of a like product down here but I'm so impressed with this mascara. I really like it. See, it doesn't even transfer. Nothing at all. And my lashes look really good still. The, the curls held up really see if this mascara is waterproof. It didn't say that it is waterproof, but I'm just gonna see. I have just water here in this spray bottle. So I'm just gonna spray it directly. Let's see. <laughs> Hmm. Okay, so there. Hmm, it's actually good. No, it's not waterproof. Yeah. Um, yeah, it is there. It is not waterproof at all. Let's see how it there so it's so easy to take this mascara off oops i didn't have to use any um eye makeup remover there it's gone all right guys so i hope that this review would help you in choosing um, a mascara, a new drugstore mascara if you're trying or looking for a new mascara to buy. I would highly actually recommend this one. I, I personally like it. I think it works well for me. Uh, it worked well with my eyelashes. So you can see I told you I didn't use any eyelash filler. Um, it didn't smudge at all. The brush, the brush itself is easy to use. I could never think it's just um, maybe what else? It is a good price for a drugstore mascara. I have nothing really bad to say about the Revlon Ultimate Mascara. Other, aside from that, it is a little bit clumpy at first when you apply it. It's a little bit on the liquidy side, but it dries up really quick. It sets on your eyelashes really quick. It never transferred. It's just a good smudge-free mascara if that's what you're looking for to buy. Like if you are looking for a smudge-free mascara, I would highly recommend that you try this Revlon Ultimate All-in-One Mascara.